Hello everyone, welcome back to the Netrock server. How are we all today? I hope everybody is doing very well indeed. So today, I'm not really sure what we're going to get up to today. I'm just kind of on the server, fancy doing a little bit of recording. Cluck, 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 chicken. And why is... There's a villager on the roof. My chickens have escaped. Oh my god. <laughs> All of my chickens have escaped and there's a... What are you doing? You should not be up here. Ah, oh, and nor should I if... With skills like that. What are you... Where have you gone? Come b get back here! What the... Come here! <laughs> Just checking there's none down there. Come... Look, what, what are you doing? Stop! Desist! Come here! You... Uh, for that trip, you... get yourself out of here! Who do you think you are, you moron? Damn! I better check what's going on down here now. <laughs> Just in case. Well, it still sounds busy though, so that's good at least. All looking good. Yeah, okay, we're all fine down here. That's the main thing. There's a block missing from there. Okay, well, at least there's that. I was concerned for a minute there. All of my chickens have escaped. There's a villager running amok on the roof. Oh, there wasn't. There was. There's not anymore. Oh, man, all these chickens. God, now I've got... Oh, they're all in the water. Oh, no. Freaking Endermen, man. Who in the hell does that? Not only that, I think this is the second time they've done that, isn't it? I'm not too fussed about the items and stuff. I've got so much food and so many feathers. It's just pest control at this stage. Ah! I hate everything, Cal! Look at me! Or don't! You what? I blatantly hit that. Come here! Invincible chicken! And like a snake stalking its prey! Pew! Pew! Haha! <laughs> Shot him in the beak! Who are you, Sky Chicken? Trees everywhere, you just sitting in there looking like a little chicken in a tree. What about you? What about you, eh? Missed. Christ almighty. Well, that's what you get for building your farms out of dirt, I guess. Or some other block that Endermen can move. Here you are, fellas. Enjoy. Okay, let's hatch these eggs then. I know there's a couple in here. There we go. So, yes, thinking Enderman was up to no good. Her face. I've replaced the missing block. Thank you, Ab. That being Toby. Uh, okay, so let us returneth home. And I've forgotten to close Steam. No wonder I'm having a slightly different frame rate than normal. There it goes. Lovely. Okay, oh, this one's laid an egg as well when he was here. Fine. Okay, so that's... Oh, we're still not done here. Be gone. Get out. And there we go. Fudge. Better. Okay. I'm buzzing. That means I need to go out soon. And... Oh, I was going to say, is that a thing? No, that's just... My roof isn't made out of black... My roof is made out of black wool. It's not normally. I heard a chicken. Why is my roof made out of black wool? Why is there brown wool? Oh! <laughs> oh! 
Oh, it was only a matter of time, but someone's come and done it. Oh. For those of you who don't know, Nay said that when she was approaching my house once that it looked a lot like Jamie Heineman out of Mythbusters. Because of the sloping roof, it looked like he was wearing a beret. So my house has been given a beret and a giant walrus moustache a la Jamie Heineman from Mythbusters. <laughs> that is what... Here we go, look. From one Mythbuster to another, it was only a matter of time. Happy April Fool's Day. Oh, Toby, you little... I don't know why I pressed control there. Oh, man, I have no ideas for April Fool's Day. Oh, this is the 31st. It's the 31st of March today I'm recording this, so quite ahead of time. Oh, man! I've got no ideas for retaliations, but I'll, I'll be sure to... Don't you worry, I'll be sure to retaliate. Oh, but I do love it. It does look exactly like Jamie Heineman. <laughs> It's so scary now that it's there. It looks just like him, and I feel like I feel compelled to keep it there. <laughs> it's my yeah, just thought I'll check the map. If someone's been here. Chances are they've changed the map, but everything looks okay anyway. Oh man, there's my Olympic, my Olympic pack, my Olympac. Why are you halfway complete? What is? Um, that's confusing. And it just started from halfway. Is that a thing now? What if I take him out? Oh my. Okay, well, that seems to be a thing now. Or maybe, I'm not sure. Um, okay, no junk from there. Nothing from there. So, between the last episode and this episode... Oh, I can't get over Jamie Heineman out there. Uh, between last episode and this episode, I've uh, we've been doing a lot of work. Look at all this stuff that I've got here. Plenty of good things just chilling out in here. All these potatoes and things like that. Doing wonderfully. Uh, actually, while we're here, I'm going to put you away. Keep you safe. And we'll put some of this other stuff away. I can hear a spider, which means we're probably not going to be able to get to bed tonight. Which is freaking annoying. And I can hear him... Oh, there's two. Of course there's two. <sighs> hate spiders. Spiders won't be so bad if they didn't make such an annoying noise. Where are they? I think they're underneath. No. Well, where are they? Oh, now all of a sudden the spiders are afraid to come out to play. Oh, unless they're on the roof. Who do you think you are? Get out of here! They, they might be up on my roof up there. Who are you?! to go to bed now. Yeah, I couldn't see them outside. Bed! No! Damn it. Okay. That must mean there's still problems afoot. Ah. Maybe it's you. Oh my god, the witch! Get out of here, witch! Oh, you... You dirty, rotten harlot! Be gone from my roof, foul wench! She gave me some glowstone, though. That's nice of her. <laughs> oh, man, look at my health. My health. My poor, poor health. My livelihood. Oh, damn it, I can't get off the roof until I'm no longer poisoned. <laughs> I am stuck up here. Until I'm better. <laughs> oh, well, that's the poison gone then, at least. Ah, oh, Jamie Heineman, though, man, that's amazing, though. I, I, I thank you, Toby, for that. I, I really appreciate you taking the effort to put Jamie Heineman on my roof. 
Or even on my whole house. I think it's only two and a half hearts for that. Oh. Are you kidding me? All I want to do is go to bed. There are no monsters. Apart from that. You are preventing me from having a good night. Now, hopefully, we may sleep. Thank you. Okay. Wow. Uh, so let's move some of these around. And let's put those in there. Lovely. They can go in there. Got anything else in this chest that I can move? Uh, these can get moved. I'm going to keep some of those emeralds on standby. I need some of those. Oh, and the quartz can go upstairs as well. So, last episode, we actually worked on the wheat farm. And I think I put in all the redstone last episode and we've got that finished. Or we, I, I got one half of the bottom floor finished at least. Well, now I'm pleased to tell you that I have gotten both halves of both both halves of both floors done which is awesome because now the thing works and my god does it work it's amazing uh, extra torches what I appear to have had a visitor Well, who the hell's turning my house upside down? Unless this was Toby as well. In which case, you got to come into your boy. Well. Huh? Ah. Let me. Let's just do this. Things got a bit tops. Damn you! My things. I hope everything's safe down here. I was going to say, if everything down here has been turned upside down as well, I will not be happy. <laughs> oh man, I've got no plans for April Fool's Day. How on earth am I... Oh man. Fine. Okay. Know this, Netrockers. Whilst it is true I have no plans for April Fool's Day, thou shalt not go untested. I shall, when I can, give you the April Fool's battering that only I can. Just be wary that it shall be belated. And it shall probably happen around June time when I have less things to do. <laughs> oh, man alive, guys. Come now. I work too much. How am I supposed to fix this and... Oh, what's going on? Why... Why must you guys be so mean to me? All I ever do is try and be nice. Not strictly true. Uh, I have my fair share. Good job, guys, though. Seriously, Shelby, Toby... I, I enjoy them a lot. The upside down house I really like. <laughs> and as for Jamie Heineman appearing on the front of my house, I am thoroughly enjoying that. <laughs> that is very nice indeed. I'm going to put these away now. And the episode has taken a bit of a different turn. It seems like I'm not going to get anything done this episode because... It's all been taken up by me exposing the cruel and wicked deeds of my fellow server mates. Curse you all. <laughs> oh, no, seriously. Good job, guys. Well done. Your, your retaliation shall be as equally entertaining, hopefully. So before we go, I will show you off this uh, the wheat farm here. This thing is biblical. Oh my goodness, if you thought the King's Mill was having a good day. Ah, oh, this thing is having a good day, week, month, even year. Okay, it rocks. 
this thing. So, so happy with it, okay? The only problem is it takes a little bit of a long time to replant, but the yield off of this thing is on another planet. Okay, I've got a little hoe in there. So, here's all the things, right? Ready? Just watch this. This is amazing. Actually, do you know what I'm going to do? Do you know what I'm going to do? Time lapse time! Oh yeah! As the sun steps down and escapes the day, we'll calmly walk away, walk away from the frame when structure falls. So, as you hopefully saw, uh, that was very laggy, um, which was a problem that I didn't quite foresee. But that gives you an idea of just how huge this thing is. The fact that none of the items are going into the hoppers anymore is another indication. Um, I mean, this thing is huge. The yield on it is phenomenal. And I'm hoping that actually that time-lapse footage is usable because it was quite jerky uh, which isn't too good but it's the only way we can indicate how truly great this is uh, I've done a count and I believe don't quote me on this but it's five stacks of plantable goods per side I have no idea where I'm going five stacks of plantable goods per side so let me just like quickly I say quickly. Let me just try and do this as quickly as I can. This is what I was saying, you see. The problem is it does take a very long time to replant this thing. But you kind of have to offset it. Yes, it takes a while, but food. Thank you, postman. Food I will never be short for ever again. In all kinds of food. All the plantable crops, I am, I am there and also, the good thing is as well, Morgan has set up a food market in Spawn, which means RATS! No, I should have bought the hoe. Morgan set up a food market in Spawn, which means that me and him might be able to do a little bit of business. You know, I might be able to supply him with food, and he might be able to supply me with valuable things, you know. So there's the opportunity for business here. I could become the premier food supplier. I could be like a cash and carry for food, you know. Just uh, giving it all out, of course. But, as, uh, as you can still see, the hoppers there are still struggling to keep up with demand here. Host po poison potatoes, we don't need those. And they're filling up gradually. Here's, here's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to come in here and put like a bunch of these things. Jesus Christ, look at it all. Just gonna put a bunch of this in here. Oh, I can't. Look, full up. Full to the bowl. Uh, so let's put some in here instead. But it's absolutely remarkable how full these get. And I've completely, of course, lost count of um, how many things I was planting. But you, you get the idea. There's so much that you can plant in here. Which is awesome. So I'm going to grab these last few bits. And then actually before we end the episode. I have one more thing that I want to do. And that is a quick trade. Because as you can see. My diamond pick there is pretty much knackered. Um, it's got I think about 5 more uses on it. It does have unbreaking 3. So let's call it about 15 uses. But. Uh, I need to start unlocking some villager trades as well, which is why I've kept the emeralds on me. So we're going to go and do a quick trade with a villager, because he can enchant that diamond pick for me. And hopefully that will unlock something new and awesome in his trade list. 
Uh, I can't remember what it is I'm trying to be able to get. For oh, forgot about this. Damn it. Can't remember what it is I'm trying to unlock from him. Oh! Oh no! Okay. So what's that? That's a bit there. I mean, good throw! But obviously not that good because I started dying. Uh, that's awesome. That's so awesome. Doo. Let's get a good old view of that. Right, let's go and do this trade. Video is getting long and I need to go out. I need to get ready <laughs> to go out. I need to go out in 10 minutes. I need to get ready. So, pew! I need to go and grab me some more ender pearls one day soon. That really wasn't as good as I was hoping. Never mind. So, oh yeah, which trader, which trader was it? Oh, I can't remember. Nor can I remember what it was I was trying to get out of him. Freaking chickens, man! Ah, so all these seeds, though. And I also bought a ton of wheat with me, didn't I? So I can... Uh, who's doing it? It's you, is it not? Oh, that's right. I think I'm just trying to... Oh. Wasn't, wasn't you. Ah, it was you! Okay, let's put that in there. And two, two of those. How about that? Full heal as well. Thank you, man. Oh, that's right. I'm hoping that he'll unlock glowstone for me at some point. But alas, not this time around. Okay, well that's us done then. Um, yes, thank you very much for watching the video, everyone. I hope you've enjoyed it. If you have, then please feel free to feel free to leave a thumbs up and a comment, letting me know what you thought. We're going to get all these chickens bred up again to make up for the ones that we killed because of their escape and treachery. And I'm going to do the same for the cows over there, or at least leave some wheat for them. Uh, but yes, anyway, thank you for watching everyone. Hope you enjoyed it. Do all, do all the thumbs up and commenty type stuff. And I will see you in the next episode. Thank you for watching. I love you. Bye.